In this problem, two objects again have identical masses and they have an elastic collision. The initial velocity of the first mass is 6 meters per second and that of the second mass is negative 3 meters per second. That is, it's moving towards the first object. What is the velocity of the first object after the collision? Now remember, here we're working with two identical masses. So we know what the result is. We know that the objects exchange velocities and exchange directions. So the information that we're given is simply that velocity of object 1 is 6 meters per second and that of object 2 is negative 3 meters per second. We also know, however, that the masses are equivalent. We're going to take advantage of that and realize that there's a swap. So we know then that if V1 was going 6 meters per second and V2 was going negative 3 meters per second, then after the collision V1 will be going negative 3 meters per second and V2 will be going 6 meters per second.